Hello and welcome back to Bard's Tale 4. I finally managed to deal with the crafting. Actually. Wait, charcoal. I'll get really angry if the game crashes on me. Quick save. We still, uh, I, s we still don't have enough gold to buy that two-handed sword. Don't worry, we are close. Hey, ah, there's so much blood around here. Well, now we can tell him that your mother was right about him. Hmm. The seal and selkie. Strongest drinks in all the Stanish Isles. Well, a drink would not go amiss. Hello, what are you guys doing? Can you not see? I want to be alone. No. Hi, Jarl Eodvast's champion. Sworn to protect him and all his family. And look at me. Poisoned. Sick. I cannot raise my sword. I cannot hold my shield. I, I let Prince Saxoff be swallowed by the fog. You let the prince die. He turned back to defend our rear. He had vast ordered me to save him, but the fumes overwhelmed me as I ran back and others carried me out. I failed my Jarl and my prince. Leave me to my shame. Strangers. Haven't seen you before. Have you just come? It's not the best time to visit Wire. Eh, uh, you wouldn't normally find us at the tavern, but we've been chased from our shop by skeletons, and there's no other place to go. What does your shop sell? Much of our stock was ruined, but we still have some good things. Will you look? Sure. Let us see what you have. Please. Let us know what you like. I think that's all. <laughs> Actually, give me all what you've got. Anything else? No. Would you like some weird things, maybe? No. I'm just looking what we can sell you. I don't know what that's for. It's a seed. Like this could be for crafting, I'm not sure. Stay safe, strangers. Hmm. Ah, adventurers. I am so glad to see you. Allow me to introduce myself. I am Prince Tan. Trader extraordinaire, known far and wide as the greatest purveyor of rare and exotic goods in all the world. Unfortunately, I have met with calamity in the one place where I am not known, and thus must find some other way to escape this frozen rock and return to civilization. And you just might be that way. What calamity has befallen you? The trip has been a disaster from the start. Sickness plagued our voyage. Half my crew vanished in Scarabray. A storm smashed us into the rocks of this ice-bound hell. And then, when we disembarked, we were beset by the undead. 
I am the sole survivor, if one can call this surviving. How can we help you? I lost all my cargo. A fortune in fabric, armor, weapons, spices, and art. But I have one thing left of value. A sword beyond compare. Razor, it is called. Swifter and sharper than any you have ever seen. If you were to buy it, I would have enough to purchase passage out of this hell. Mm. Sure. Thank you. You have saved me. It's yours. It's gonna be Your shitty, isn't it? Get me home. Oh, really? Yeah, it's shitty. <laughs> but what do you need? Compared to what we are using. Mm -hmm. but what a I am a good bard, okay? Nice. What's on? Best fish of the fleet I was. The best. Torah Will came along. Bloody blue as behemoth. It's not a whale's fault. The best fish of the fleet? Truly. I was. I once caught so many fish. I had to go back and get another boat. What did the whale do to you? Evil minion of Umien. Harpunta, a mile east of Strondsee. Smashed my boat. Killed my crew. But I held on. Though she went down to the depths and dragged me through the waves, I held fast and drove my boat ever deeper. Till at last, with a great twist and leap, she shook me at last and left me clinging to my broken mast. <laughs> oh, 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 for the look she gave me before she submerged again. The endless depths of a huge black eye. <laughs> I must see it always, except when I drink. So I am never not drinking. Never. Farewell. Okay. What do we have? Not much food left, but the cellar's full. So name your poison. What's the local specialty? Do you mean Selkie's tears? I don't know. Well, I'll sell it to you, but fair warning. It'll make you want to kiss seals and go swimming in the sand. Okay, what do you have? have a new... book. What else do you have? So, can I buy everything? Nope. The answer to that is no. Roll plank with hell, actually. Yeah, I don't think it will be useful in crafting. Okay, I'll keep those. 140. Mm, take the torch. Do this. Okay, this is definitely not for. Okay, I'll remember where we leave it. Okay. <laughs> We have plenty of alcohol now, we can oh we can learn how to make a cider and something with cabbage. Baked potatoes. Beast and cabbage, meat, cooking herbs, cabbage and potato. 
Um, where's the cider? Like, it's not showing up in the alcohol. Ah, there it is. Isn't food? I'm, I'm not asking. I am not asking, but I am saving the game. Aren't you our friend? I don't think so. Sorry, your worships. No jokes today. And particularly no jokes for snooty elves. Also, no capering, cavorting, frolicking, hijinks, repartee or innuendo. This nightmare has drained all the jesting right out of me. I'm an empty wine sack that has no wine in it. You've got something against elves? Curse bringing snobs. We trow as elves once, did you know that? Then the other elves cursed us and left us like this. Short, ugly and bat-eared. At least we still got our sense of humor. Bastards. What happened to you? One minute I'm doing handsprings and making fun of the high Jarl's belly, which is my solemn duty as court jester. The next, we're all running out of the castle, heaving up our breakfasts with skeletons clattering after us. Now everybody's dead, and everybody who isn't is sick. Just... just not a lot of good material in it, really. Not that it matters. Nobody's in a laughing mood anyway. Are you selling anything? I have a few things I managed to grab on the way out of Langskull. Have a look if you want. Well, not like I have gold for anything. Ooh, I like how it looks. Really? <laughs> I really like the way it looks. Hmm. It gets rid of all my spell points. Mm, Falcon times fewer explosions do less damage, but also hit enemies near the target. Yeah, I don't like that. Song of Compass or Cavorting Wound, and if the target is damaged. Mm. Archer Speed. Eh. I would love to have a Jester's Hat. Hmm. Uh. Well, thank you. Keep smiling. I'm ignoring this guy on purpose. Hey! You! Okay, fine. Who approaches? Have a care. A wounded boar fights all the harder. You're no folk of mine. Why have you come to my fog poisoned isle? Are there any ruins in the of the Tron in these isles? I have heard of no such places here. My priest Loagnar might know. Okay, we seek news of uh, Lago of Santa. <laughs> <coughs> well, you found it. He's behind all this. The poisoned air. The treachery of the priestesses of Orkan. The loss of the axe by which I rule. My... <laughs> My wife is dead. My son. Oh, I wish I knew. And I have no carols well enough to search for him. I don't... I don't suppose... Oh, Father Wagner says I should wait. But I'm damned if I will. You look fighting fit. Will you search for him? If you seek Xanta, they're in the same place. Langskal, my castle. Okay, tell us of this axe. The dragon axe, wielded by Halvard, father of Aethelrud, slayer of Anderstorst, the great worm that once terrorized these isles. It has symbolized our right to rule ever since. Lag of Santa is behind the poison fog? Aye, he appeared in the middle of my throne room and spread it from his bony fingers. My men died in droves, then rose undead. We had to retreat. Ah, oh, 
to be driven from my own castle and forced to rule from an alehouse. Has any high Jarl suffered such a humiliation? You say the priestesses of Orkanals and the inn. Many fear the priestesses of the Raven, for they know our dreams. But they've always been loyal to the Jarls of the Stenish Isles. This treachery is devastating. What happened to your son? When Xanta appeared, Saxulf ran at him. We... we never saw him again. The heir. We were forced to fall back. I'm so ashamed. I must save him. I must. We were told Xanta came here seeking the blood of Ethelrood. Do you know what that might mean? The blood of Ethelrood? I am the blood of Ethelrood, as is my son. All the high Jarls of the Einar. Is that why? Has the fiend captured Saxulf to take his blood? God, Sam. Friends, I beg you. We want the same thing. Stop Xanta and save my son. And you will have all that a high Jarl of the Einar may give. We will do what we can. Please, help me. He doesn't ask much, does he? Poison is a coward's weapon. If Xanta has taken the castle, then to the castle we must go. His son will be dead when we find him, won't he? Now, are you willing to speak with us? A moment, strangers. So, Eadvast sends you to do what I warned him against. Well... Perhaps you are the sign we have been waiting for. But you will die if you enter the castle. The tainted air will kill you before you take three steps. Take this key and go to the temple of Vildsvin. My superior there, High Priest Braka, will give you a blessing to keep you safe from the poison. Then you may enter the castle. Vildsvin is a god. The Einar god of war. The great boar who protects his sow and his young. Calm in peace, but fierce in battle. Is it true the priestesses of Orkan are in league with Lago of Zanta? Their treachery is a terrible blow. For what has betrayed us to this wraith? Power? Pride? Who knows? Why can't High Priest Braca heal the High Jarl and his men with his blessing? Because the blessing cannot cure the sick, only prevent the healthy from sickening. What do you know of Leg of Santa? Only that he is more powerful than any enemy the High Jarl has ever faced. If you fail to stop him, I fear he will be the doom of these isles. Mm, are there any ruins of the Tarn in these isles? None that I know of. Our gods would not allow them to exist. Okay, thank you for your advice. We shall seek out High Priest Braca. See High Priest Braca. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thank you. you will not enter the castle. I said thank you. More blood. That's the sound of a spooky and snow is wondering what is cracking so much. Let's save. Okay. Vertigo warning. If you get sick easily, don't look don't look. What do you need? Darkness take me. Goodbye yep. for now. Still Ready. Arm never lost yet. Stand with me, friends. My man, I will tear you apart. Yes. Okay. Tell me what you need. Ready. On your word. Ah! 
<laughs> he was hit. Ready. And you can also start channeling. Unfortunately, that didn't work entirely. Tell me. Speak. Whatever. Yeah, I think that's it. Ready. I would like you to call him over. Now please be a dear and call him over here. Speak. I thirty seven enough. Will those work? They do. Wait, where are we? Ah, oh, we are over here. I don't know why it always shows the map like so. Well, we are over here. Oh well. That made no sense. Thank you. All oh, right, we leveled up. You. You are gonna dual wield because you can dual wield two handed weapons, apparently. Uh, don't, I don't think there's anything from defense that you need. Deploy a shield with four constitution for one turn, deal 15 physical to any enemy directly ahead when destroyed by enemies. A critical blocking a physical melee attack with shield stuns the attacker. Give me that. By the way, do we have. Another. God damn it. Wait, what was that? You may equip one handed weapons in your off hand, but there was something about her. I was to use two handed weapons in your main hand. So we need to find a one handed weapon for you. The other hand. Aye. Away I go. Why are you guys so big? Darkness, take me. To me, to me! You must die! 
It was worth to try. Is there anything else? I mean, you can meditate, but it leaves us with one. Tell me what you need. Maybe he'll move. He's move. No. Can kill him. I mean, like this, and it's still done. Oh, I want to level up. You. Maybe some more defense for you. Some more constitution. Um. Oh. Meditating and plus one is popular with when meditating, yes. What now? We're going into brewing. Okay. Okay. That makes sense. That's another trap. Oh, just deal with it. What do you mean you cannot push it over there? There you go, I dealt with it. <laughs> oh, that doesn't look good. Fine at all. But I'm gonna end this part here, so for now, thank you very much. Stay alive and see you soon. Bye!